We also mentioned intellectual property. <laughs> so, so IP work is very interesting. Um, I think a lot of people who are in the um, technology field or who have tech businesses um, often think that the first thing you need to do when you um, want to start your business is to have an NDA to be able to talk to anybody about your product. And I think that is a mistake. Be one, because if you cannot talk about your product without revealing proprietary information, then there, there's a problem, right? You should, because you wouldn't be sharing that with your customers anyway, right? You would be sharing with them why they should be buying it, why they should be engaging with you, et cetera. And it shouldn't have to include proprietary information to be able to, to give that to um, your client. And then two, I think NDAs are overused and under um, the value and what you think you're getting with an NDA is not necessarily realized. So non-disclosure agreements, that's what NDA stands for, sorry, um, generally speak to um, you know, that there's some information that you're exchanging with someone and you, they are not allowed to speak on it unless, you know, if there are exemptions, like if it's already out in the open, et cetera. Um, but there should be some form of exchange of communication. So if you, if your NDA is only so that you can tell someone about it, then it doesn't really fully, um, fully represent the relationship in that NDA. And so to me, it's kind of useless. And just because you have an NDA doesn't mean that people won't talk about your business or won't tell people about it, et cetera. And in a way, I don't think it's bad to have other people talking about your business and things like that. And I don't think, and I think NDAs make people feel, feel as though they should be fearful about sharing their ideas. And so they, because it's like, if you share it, someone might steal it and take it and go do it. And that's not necessary. I mean, it happens. I won't say it doesn't happen, but I don't think that's the, the, Foot, footing you should be on when you talk about your business. It should be more about what problem you're solving, what the solution is, and how it could benefit your customers. Not, oh, if I tell you about it, you're gonna take it and then take my money. Technically, you haven't even made any money yet, right? So you have to also think about that. So is it really a business if you haven't actually um, earned any income and you're not out in the market, et cetera? Um, not to say that you shouldn't have an NDA in place, I'm just saying that to be, when you think about putting an NDA in place, think about all the things that come along with it and why you're doing it, not because some incubator said that you should do it, right? You should do it because there is an exchange of information that you want to keep confidential and that person will likely be an investor maybe or that person will likely be a partner. Like there are certain people you would want to have an NDA with. You wouldn't have that with your customer 